What's so cool about pi? Not that pi, this pi. Calculating the digits of pi is something computers use to benchmark their performance. Applications like SuperPi and HyperPi benchmark your PC or laptop based on this calculation. And there are computer geeks out there that have built off-the-shelf hardware to calculate pi to the trillions of digits. But why pi? Why not some other number? Well, firstly, pi is irrational, meaning its digits go on till infinity. That's really cool because it would be hard to benchmark your computer if the calculation stopped at the third, fourth, even the millionth digit. The infinite property of pi allows us to calculate infinitely. Pi is also random. As far as we can tell, there's no way to predict the next digit of pi other than calculating it. For example, 2 divided by 3 results in an irrational but non-random number. Would you know the 1 millionth digit of 2 divided by 3? So we need irrational, random numbers, and there are a few, but none of them hold that special place in our heart like pi. Now that's the easy part. Calculating pi to the trillions of digits means that all trillion plus operations that result in that calculation need to be precise and accurate. Every bit in memory, every bit written to the hard disk, everything needs to be just right because otherwise you get an error. So calculating pi isn't just about creating a faster machine, it's about creating a more robust and reliable one as well. So let's all thank Pi.